Mr. Blue. Hi, buddy. You see that brand on his face? This one right here? I've had a ton of people ask me about that brand and about this horse's brands in general. So we're gonna get him worked and then I'm gonna answer those questions. You know, I've had a bunch of people ask me on this channel and on Instagram about Blue's brands. So I figured we would just run over the brands that Blue has on him as well as Leah's and Smoke's lack thereof. First and foremost, we will start with Blue's left shoulder, his left front shoulder. That is his brand from the ranch that he came off of. Can't really tell what it is. Looks like there's an S somewhere in there, but I don't really know what this is. I'm not as familiar with the ranch that Blue came off of. It's not like the Babbitt Ranch, the King Ranch, or Tongue River, or Memory Ranches, or anything like that that is super familiar. This one, I've had a hard time really figuring out what it is. It kind of just looks like a, an S with something you know mixed in there with it. I've seen one other horse with it, and they really didn't know either, so I really couldn't tell you on that one. A lot of times ranches will put their ranch brand on the front shoulder or on the hip. I've even seen it as low as kind of in this meaty area right here. I don't actually know what that area is, but I have seen some ranch brands in this area. Most of the time you're going to see them on the hip and you're going to see them on the shoulder and every once in a while you'll see it on their cheek, but Blue's ranch brand right there on his left shoulder. The next brand we'll go over is this one on his cheek. And this is the most asked one that I get. This is actually his mare's number. A lot of times on these bigger outfits, they have so many brood mares and they number their mares. And so this just distinguishes that he is out of the 22 mare. I kind of like it because one of my favorite numbers growing up was the 22 and uh, it's right there on his left cheek. He looks so good being a number 22. So. Left cheek on this horse, his mare's number. Rolling around to the back side of this horse, on his left cheek is the number six. That is actually the year that he was born. He's an 06 model, so he's got a number six on his left cheek. And that actually helps me remember how old he is sometimes. So that's pretty easy on blue. Just a quick recap. 22 on his cheek, that's his mare's number. Left front shoulder. That is the ranch that he came off of, and the six on his hip, that is his birth year. Okay, moving over to Miss Leah. Now, in the English world, they do things a touch different. They have brands based on their breed, not based on what ranch or what breeder they came from or what farm they came from. So Leah is a Dutch warm blood, so she only has one brand. It's on her left hip, ho. Oh. And you can barely, barely see it right there. It's a lion, and uh, that shows that she is a Dutch warm blood. I know that there's a bunch of different breeds out there, and I think they all have their own different ones, and it's a little bit different from the Western world. But that's it on Leah. Nice and easy. Hey, let me boop. Boop. All right, moving along to Mr. Smoke. You done with your fly mask? All right. If I can do it one-handed, that'd be great. Perfect. Now the old man himself, Mr. Smoke. Smoke does not have any brands. And that's one of the reasons why we were having a hard time figuring out how old he was or where he came from, to be honest with you, because he doesn't have any brands. He is brandless. He's also paperless. He is just a really, really solid grade horse. No brands on him whatsoever, I know. Papers aren't everything in this world. Brands aren't everything in this world. 
He's probably one of the better horses that I've ever ridden and no papers, no brand. You know, I like the thought of having a Hauser Sport Horse brand on our horses, but you know, he's 25, she just turned 20 and Blue is 15. It's like, what's the point of actually having a brand on these horses? We love them, they're not going anywhere. Everybody knows that they're ours. On the younger horses, we will be branding. I, I do think that that's a cool thing when you um, train your own horses to put a brand on them. But these horses may not have a Hauser Sport Horse brand on them, but we love them and that's, uh, that's all that really matters. I hope that answers a few of your questions. Why Blue has three brands, why Leah has one, and why Smoke doesn't have any. Hopefully it answers some questions and gives you a little bit of an introduction into horse branding. As always, make sure that you subscribe to this channel. We love seeing all the new subscribers. We cannot thank you enough. We'll see you guys next time.